The purpose of this video is to tell us as young people to start up something. The purpose of this video is to give us a business mindset of what is happening in the world and why we need to style up and why we need to start up things as soon as possible. Why? Because the times are changing, the times are running very fast. Every single day, innovators are rising, every single day, creators are rising, every single day, entrepreneurs are rising. Where is your place? All of us we are created to be great we all have greatness within us but we are supposed to bring out that greatness we are supposed to manifest that greatness you might ask me but simon if all of us are going to be ceos of certain companies of certain ventures then who are going to be the workers all of us we are created with a certain bit of greatness you and i are unique you and i are special we all have our differences we all have our specialities but we uh, actually let me tell you this greatness is a product of influence your life cannot be great if you're not influencing if if your life is not having influence over some people and influence is a product of significance you cannot have influence over people when your life is not significant or important and significancy or importance is a product of value you have value within you and because you are valued and your life has value and that and and and, and you're adding value on people's lives so you become significant value is a product of refinement that means the more you submit yourself under things that are refining you under mentors under tutorials under 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 webinars under courses under conferences that are teaching your mind then you're working upon your value ladies and gentlemen my friend when your value is high then you will have significance your life will have importance and value is a product of refinement just like we talked about gold the other day gold is mined as an oil but it undergoes refinement it goes through fire it goes through processes that bring out the best in it that you find a small bit of gold i don't have any gold here with me but I would have showed you a small bit okay let's say this is gold you get a small bit like this but millions of dollars why because it underwent a refinement and its value was hyped and its value was manifested and let me tell you something refinement depends on your uniqueness like i told you all of us have a particular uniqueness god created you with a particular uniqueness and that uniqueness is what determines what process or what refinement you are going to undergo just like you see gold has to go through fire it has to go through smelting it has to go through all those different processes to bring out the gold the, the value in it some of us we are unique at singing some of us we are unique at playing this some of us we are unique at creating that means our refinements are supposed to be in line with our uniquenesses are we together and then uniqueness is a product of a gift your gift is what makes you unique <laughs> are we together and guess what the gift is given from god it is God who gives you the gift. So you can see the process. God, gift, uniqueness, refinement, value, significance, influence, then greatness. All of us have the greatness within us. It is fully embedded within us. But we are supposed to go through the different processes in life to bring out, to manifest that greatness in our different spaces of life. You can be great at singing. You can be great at teaching. You can be great at, at, at innovating. You can be great at creating. You can be great at photography. You can be great at entrepreneurship. Uh, you can be great at a specific thing. But for you to be great at that particular thing, that is the process are we together now this is what i want to leave you with deep within you is a person that no one knows yet you might be in self-regret you might be in self-condemnation you might be you might be in comparison you might you might be seeing other people doing well and you'll be like oh i'm not like them maybe i i, I was meant to be here maybe i was i don't have what it takes but let me tell you something you have what it takes because god has created it within you he has engrafted it within you and you just need to go through the process trust the process take a step of faith sometimes you need to just take the step of faith yes in my in, in the business world they call it making a risk but move 
and then you'll see the greatness within you coming to pass through the refinement if you're a singer and you want to become great at singing then you get to sit under a music coach if you are a basketball player you have to sit under a basketball coach if you want to be a speaker for example in what we are doing in what i'm doing right now i look up to people like flavia tunsime i look up to people like simon senkai i look up to people like um simon sinek les brown bishop bishop td jakes uh, dr miles apostle grace Rubega my spiritual father the more i look at them the more i learn their steps the more i listen unto them boy i'm being refined and the more i'm refined the value that is out of me is getting bigger and bigger time is going to come when the value that is within me is so great that it is able to eat to have significance on people's lives and with that significance will come the influence and with that influence so is that greatness that is the recipe there is no magic there is no rocket science in it it is as plain as that you are great discover your true self and inspire others to do the things that inspire them that is what we are created for it doesn't matter what space of life you're in it doesn't matter what career you're in it still applies it crosses over because you know you can be great your particular field share this with a friend share it with a family share it with a co-worker share it with your best friend and let them know that hey they have greatness within them did you did you guys actually know that part of being great is the ability to manage anger did you know that part of being great is the ability to control anger? Ladies and gentlemen, I want to let you know, people are going to try you. You're going to be tried. You're going to be triggered. Very many times, people are going to try and trigger you because they don't know firstly what you're up to. They don't understand you maybe. They have not yet been with you for a while, so they do not know. They don't know what triggers you and what, what doesn't trigger you. But let me tell you, part of being great is the ability to control your anger. And just in case you're not aware, I made a video for you right here so check it out it's going to open your eyes to mysteries it's going to open your eyes to solutions it's very simple it's very clear but otherwise greatness is within you i repeat greatness is within you i repeat there is greatness within you choose to wake up every morning as a great person because that is what god has put in you you are great you are great you are great i repeat you are great subscribe <laughs>